Hello, I'd like to play another session of Pandora Eclipse of Nashira. Uh, this time I'm playing with a uh, development version, um, which uh, the number here you can ignore, this will not be the number of the next version, it's just in this case for me. Uh, we have uh, concluded to not increase the number. And I will also play with a mod that allows more factions. Uh, the factions are taken from Alpha Centauri, so there are uh, a total of 21 factions now. I will still play random and everyone else will also play random. And uh, I will, in addition, will try very hard. Uh, the last few times I played hard, I eventually could win. Uh, but this time it has become a little bit more difficult hopefully because I have done some further AI improvements so let us see how it goes and start the game it is the year 21. yeah I got one of the Alpha Centauri factions this mod even has uh, language and since I never played Alpha Centauri and don't know what this is okay it's Captain Sven's skirt I actually I do know what it is uh, they have uh, minerals from ocean tiles uh, which is uh, I think really strong and they also start with an amphibious former so they are quite good I suppose uh, and I did the same mistake I've done before many times which is founding the city right away without uh, scouting out the area but I think this uh, starting location is quite decent um, foot is a little bit lacking but we have uh, three forests already and a high yield mineral field so for the start I will not be needing more than this one and let me check okay I do not have problems with pollution so I can start with this and I can already build naval transport logistics uh, let's see the research I will start by putting one worker I will lock everything and then I will start building grows to uh, size three which is a succor technique and I don't know how it's pronounced uh, but he invented this kind of start and uh, since he always wins or most of the time he wins I think the start shall be good and I will be scouting a little bit let's send the former over here and build the mine and I will send a soldier in the other direction okay yeah over here we have another resource but it is out of the range I think or is it one two yeah it is slightly out of the range or is it no it is yes it is okay a little bit confused so I start with these two technologies uh, and I can get this here right away but I will get uh, colony ship dismantling it's uh, here's this mod has one more technology which is the recycling tanks it's an early building it's it's not really good but uh, it can help to and uh, I think there's another change I don't know if I have unlocked it yet yes yes here we have a nerve stapling but that's about it what uh, when it comes to technologies the rest really is only the races from Alpha Centauri okay in this direction I do not need to continue scouting so I go over here and here is better anyways because there is a ruin The aliens are not aggressive yet so what did we get 17 foot okay this will keep me going a little longer 
And here we have an observatory. I don't really like the surrounding. Uh, if, if I had scouted this first and built here, well, this would also have disadvantage of not having a lot of minerals early on. Only after the first city expansion, which will take quite a while. Okay, here we have an alien nest. The surrounding era area does really not look that good. Observatory, but it is right to the alien nest, so before I can think about colonizing, I have to clear that out. Uh, I could kill them. I think I might... No, it's just... They will get aggressive quicker if I kill one, but if I can, why not? So, the former... I think I can also mine the water tiles as the pirates. Yes, because they get... Uh, higher yield from water tiles, though they are like mountains. No, nope, you will heal. I don't want to risk losing you. And I got colony ship dismantling at, at the si same time the city grew, which is uh, really the point of this technique. But now I'm running out of minerals, so I can get a lot of minerals from my super mineral source. More than I can spend, actually. So I think uh, I can, I should get the water first, anyways. This is also slightly out of range. If the city was here, I would have all three resources in range, but I couldn't have known that. So I'll take the water tiles anyways. They are better. I could also start farms on the water, now that I think about it. Yeah, I'll probably do this. Uh, but I shall use that I have uh, such a high mineral income anyways can give me a nice boost in production I probably should have turned this a uh, farm well, I still can do this. I get the forest in the meantime over here for some more reduced uh, pollution. And naval transport logistics. Should I be getting this? I think so since I don't have anything else to build uh, which I should change by putting more people into research let's do it like this, I got the minerals anyways from the colony ship dismantling okay mining I think I will put it in front because I don't really need that yet. What else? Synthetic fertilizer should help me with food. And after that, <coughs> I will be getting. Yeah, it is nicely aligned here. Steel reinforced plates and infernal pre-igniter. I will get both and then I can build much stronger units. 
In the meantime, I probably shall also get the barracks. Yeah, I will probably research the barracks first. And I also want the defensive building. Okay, and now I go back to the water and build a mine here. I shall try and walk onto the observatory. This will uncover a larger area. Uh, but it doesn't work too much. Oh, over here we have uh, another faction. And the question really is... Um, it looks like it is uh, Divine Ascension. But it might also be one of the factions from Alpha Centauri. I can't really tell. If it is Divine Ascension, I might be in trouble. I probably should contact them a little bit later. I don't want them to declare war outright, which could happen because I'm really weak. So I'll scout to the north a little bit. But it looks like there is, is not very much. Down here is another alien hive. Not too favorable. So let's get this. Hot springs, okay. Uh, it should be possible to get both the hot springs and the observatory. But the alien hive is in the way. Maybe there's a little bit more even. Let's check the city. It has grown. Yeah, I can now get more production. I still have no pollution due to all the forests. As you can see, minus 4 from the forests and 3.2. Uh, waste is created. So I'll line this up. Oh, yes, this looks pretty nice. If I found here, I have the hot springs, this, and I will also get this, unless those guys get it before me. But this would be a nice city location. It's not the best in food, but I can get food out of the water here. Um, and I can, and can get food and minerals from the water, I think. I see which one is more important, usually the one that I use more people for. You can uh, use the same tile twice, so I can put, uh, if I put a uh, worker and a farmer, one uh, post can go here. It's not like in Civilization where you can put only one person on one tile. Yeah, you can do it with two. Okay, first upgrade for my units. I will improve the armor. No reason not to really. And it looks a little dangerous here. The aliens might become aggressive pretty soon. Yeah, it's turn 18. I think it might be around turn 20. So I might want to turn back. Okay, now I have a better food tile. Uh, then I can start building roads. And infernal pre-igniter. Or should I get this first? No. But, hmm. I can kill another alien, but this is too risky then they if they become aggressive then and I can't get back in time I better head back now okay I run out of minerals but no problem with just one uh, miner I'll I'm be getting 12 minerals right now this is more than my it's way more I still have plus four so 
can't really spend it with my workers. But it's quite nice, so I can can get a few units out. And maybe the building as well. Uh, let's right click the city. And size 5, let's check it out. I could even support one more worker with the super mine and the refining array. This is a great uh, bonus tile. But it has one minus one morale. Okay, alien aggression is imminent. The closest type is there. It will take them one, two, yeah, maybe three turns. So. I get one of those. I'm having a little cash I can upgrade. 32 credits. I'll upgrade again once it is possible. Okay, alien aggression. I think I mentioned that. Hold position and yeah, let's kill this guy. He's only. 0.5 strength, but he can become really annoying if not dealt with. And I can now uh, equip Xenomorph Pharaoh Pharaohpot, but uh, I don't know if I will eventually do it. I might, but not for the first few units. I first need more firepower, and I feel I need more science too. Let's do it like this and build one more. I'm in need of more technology. And Hellfire, great. Since I will be fighting aliens most of the time right now, this might be better. Mm, do I finish this guy? I can upgrade him. Yes, I, I do. It might be a little bit wasted to upgrade level 1 units, but better safe than sorry. And yeah, I need the barracks still don't want to produce too many troops before having them. I'll be lo uh, lacking on the on the levels for the troops. You also go back to the city to get an upgrade. But I'm not making too many credits right now. I think now would be a better time to contact the this faction over there and a training facility because I now have a few units and they might not think of me like a victim anymore. Uh, I need both of these. I think I'll need this more because I otherwise can't even spend my minerals. Uh, I can put everyone on here, so I get a training facility. Let's get it before the next trooper. The big aliens should not be aggressive yet. This should be more close to turn 40. It's not that far away. Okay, I won't be able to upgrade the next unit. Because it's too expensive and I do not have enough income. I think I pay quite a bit for troops. Yeah, for... Uh, 
Um, but I want a little bit more of scouting information. If uh, for the case that aliens are coming over here, so this is fine, setup wise. But now I will lock it. Hmm, what to get now? Did that just? Am I having a deja vu? No, wait. Uh, this is ready now, but I want more research. Mm, I think it was like this before. But I don't have anything to build. I mean, I can still produce these. I get another one and I will increase taxes. Uh, not sure if it is too good of an idea to come close to that, but if I stay in the forest, it shouldn't harm me much. Let's see, victory chances are pretty pretty low. But if I get I can flank it, but I would need more units for that. Um, there's an alien firing out of it. Okay, I got this now. Increased research speed, also important. But I think public gene theory uh, might be better long term. Okay, let's get this. So I can finally use up my minerals with much less workers. And I'm having a food problem. I can assign one here and I can take the food from this water farm which I could build because I started with a water farm because of my faction. I'm not sure I think the factions of Alpha Centauri or like they are in this game uh, in this mod they are not quite balanced. I think some factions are clearly too strong. We played a little bit in multiplayer. I haven't really played it in single player that much. Actually this is the first time I play it in single player. And every time I played in multiplayer, I got one of the normal Pandora factions, so not that much diversity. And I'm a little uh, confused that there are so few aliens. I think I set it to very high, but they might have gone off to the south where probably someone else is residing. I'm playing with two more factions than normal, it's nine factions, it's, it can become a little confusing I think. But for the time being, it is, okay, okay, this guy is stepped out of the hive, so he would be attackable. But I would have to come close to the hive to do so, so I do not want to do that. Also I would have to step onto the fungus and I also do not want to do that. Okay, I basically I have built everything I could. Except for colonizer. But I first want to clear the hives. Let's see the research. I'd like to get this module for that. But I also need some more research. Okay. 
Well, however, that's it for the first part and I will continue tomorrow, I think. And we shall see how it goes. Do I have contact? No. But I know that someone is over here and I suppose that it might be uh, Divine Ascension. So, but we'll see. We will see that tomorrow. Goodbye.